Hi, this is Matt from Motu. Today I'm going to show you a couple of my favorite features in Mach 5.3. And these have to do with the EARCOM granular and EARCOM stretch oscillators. Now that might sound complicated, but it's actually easy to use. Let me demonstrate it for you. I've got Mach 5.3 running as a standalone application, and I've got a stereo audio clip right here on the desktop. I'm going to drag it into the main window. You can see it maps across the entire key range and the entire velocity range. The red key indicates it's the root. In the upper left corner, I'm going to switch from sample to the EARCOM stretch. Now you can see we've got some parameters here for editing. In the upper right, let's choose the preset complex. I'm also going to click on the stereo button, which will maintain the best stereo field when I start doing pitch shifting and time stretching. So let me play this example for you. So I'm using the Star Wars main title cue because it's so widely recognizable. It's also a good example to use because it's a hundred piece orchestra playing complex rhythms, complex harmonies with overtones, and you have room ambience as well to deal with. So it's a good example of how good these algorithms really are. So now that we can see we've got the speed set to one, everything I play back will play back at the same tempo. So now we're able to manipulate the pitch without altering the tempo. So now let's play Star Wars back down a minor third. Listen to the quality. Let's play it down a major third. Listen how cleanly it plays that back. Now we can do some interesting things, like I might play a tritone with the C at the same time. Listen to what this layer sounds like. That's pretty crazy. This algorithm is so good. Listen to what it sounds like down an octave. Let's say I play it with the upper C. Now listen to it in octaves. That just demonstrates how good the algorithm is. And really, it's not just about having great algorithms. What's making this work so beautifully is the Mach 5.3 engine. This is the UVI Engine XT, which represents really the best sonic engine on the market for really any sampler. So putting this in practical terms, let's say you've finished a project for a client and they've now asked for a version that's transposed. Let's say it needs to be down a full step, down a minor third. You could drop the cue into Mach 5.3, load Mach 5.3 into your digital audio workstation as a plugin, trigger the MIDI event, and then create a new version taking Mach 5.3 and using it to do amazing pitch shifting as much as a fourth, a fifth, and sometimes even an octave for various layers. So now we haven't actually manipulated the tempo at all, but let's actually deal with the speed. So if I'm going to play back the original version, let's speed it up and slow it down and listen to how well it does this. So that's an amazing tool as well. And by the way, all of these parameters, you can right click and do MIDI learn. So if you have a MIDI controller, you're able to actually record those events into your digital audio workstation. So imagine you've got this cue and it's cut to a click at a fixed tempo. Now you could go back and you could assign this speed knob to a knob and you could do little slowdowns, little retardandos and accelerandos to sort of speed up and slow down the piece of music when it plays back. That's a brilliant way to use this tool. So again, very practical stuff that we can do with the EarCom stretch in Mach 5.3.